Joe's Jossen started his own pigeon racing career in 1976. At first, he used his father's pigeons as the basis for the loft. In the next few years, he was mainly through exchange and co-breeding, and eliminations from competitions, and successfully laid the foundation for his loft. Joe's Jossen is good at the middle and long distance. In recent years, he has made great achievements and important European national competitions. In 2006, he won the international first prize from Perpignan, Cosmic Diamond, and in 2010, he won the international first prize from Marseille against 10,443 pigeons, Universal Invincibility. Joe's Jusen, a big name in international pigeon racing, win the first classic from the Rhone Valley in 2012, the national from Montelimar. Walloon fanciers often describe this race as the Little Barcelona, referring to the demanding circumstances during the race. The winning pigeon of Joe's Jusen finished in 17 hours 4 minutes 44 seconds in a race of 757.634 kilometers. This resulted in the highest speed at national level, 1,252.83 meters per minute. What a difference to the middle and grand middle distance races earlier that day, where the pigeons reached a speed of about 1,700 meters per minute. These pigeons had to watch out not to fly past their own lofts. But it illustrates the difficulty of the national race from Montelimar, with a strong headwind in the Rhone Valley for the first half of the race. These pigeons only had a tailwind in the final kilometers of the race, after they had left the valley. That also explains why the fastest speeds were registered on the shorter distances. Joe's Jusen was already quite impressive and now he adds another national victory from Montelimar. Here is the list of Joe's achievements. With these results, Joe's Jusen is definitely one of the best middle distance fanciers, and he can be ranked among the greatest. He has also had countless provincial wins including Argentin, Cares, Marseille, Pau, Perpignan, Dax, Beziers, Bordeaux, Orange, Garrette, with the youngsters in 2011. An ever-growing list of achievements, there seems to be no end. Besides, the first national ace pigeon, middle distance KBDB, Magic Ike from Chris Haberich stems from a direct Joe's Jusen hen as well, a sister of first national Propignan. Joe's Jusen is one of a kind. Joe's Jusen is a no-nonsense fancier. The phenomenal bunga line plays an important part in this success story, as it forms the basis of the loft buildup. He came into contact with pigeon racing when his mother died in 1976. His father was alone, and he asked Joe's to get him some pigeons to ease his mind a little. But after a while his father did not care for his pigeons anymore, he had found a new love, which resulted in him moving to the Netherlands, so Joe's decided to take over the pigeons. Shortly after Joe's bought some pigeons from Albert Franken, including the lines of Heiskens Van Riel, Van Rien Cloak and Rost. With the help of these lines he soon became a champion in the sprint races, but he had even greater ambitions. With these pigeons, he soon had his first top-class breeding couple, which would play a key role in his loft for many years to come and even today. The cock was out Bonga, BE 75 616 65 30. A descendant of Heiskens Van Riel cross Van Rien Cloak, cross hen from the lines of Heiskens Van Riel. First of all, this couple bred an exceptional racer for the middle distance, Jong Bonga. This pigeon was later to become one of the stock breeders of his loft, and was renamed Bonga. He appears in the pedigrees of the winner of first international Marseille 2010, and of the winner of Montelimar 2012. He was coupled to the Sprout hen, which he got from a round of eggs he bought from the legendary Sprout of Van Oyrishit in Put Kaplan and that was the start of an amazing career which continues today.
At a certain point in time, Joe's had about 50 direct descendants of these pigeons in his loft. This gives you an idea of how important these pigeons have been for the family of pigeons of Joe's Jusen and will be in the future. About 80 to 85 percent of his pigeons today are descendants of these lines. We are talking about pigeons that were very good in the sprint and middle distance, and that are now excelling in the national middle distance and international long distance competitions. They are very all-round racers. From time to time, he added some other pigeons. Throughout the years the loft welcomed pigeons of Gabby van den Abel, Jack van der Weggen, L. van Mengsel, Luke van Koppenol, Roger Desmet Mathages, Stefan Meermans, Jan Thielen, Hubert de Ben, Marcel Albrecht, Van Uerkert Deckers, Roger Vreek, and Chris Haberricht. In 2022, the 78 years old Joe's is still full of positivity and vigor. He still hops, as it were, through his house and his yard to his lofts. Blessed with an incredibly good mood and robust health, it is truly infectious to see someone at that age at work. With his wife Gerda, they are a splendid duo who amuse themselves daily with the pigeons, bicycles, children, grandchildren, friends and much more. Joe's eyes shine when he tells about his pigeon exploits, and they are many and magnificent. After the October 2021 pigeon theft run sack his colony, in total of 115 pigeons including the top 50 national pigeons. Joe's still managed to come back in the spotlight by winning the first ace pigeon KBDB Roan 2022. The three-year-old blue cock that won this wonderful ace title. The Valens, Montelimar, and Marseille flights are known to be rock hard, and reserved for the strong among the strong. Traditionally, Joe's pigeons score very well on these flights. Once they won the first international Marseille, one of the founders of this colony, on a rock-hard flight and also the first national Montelimar. These conditions are tailor-made for Joe's pigeons. Despite for very tempting bids, Joe's kept his first international Marseille in his breeding loft, a gateway to strong progeny opened up both for himself and others. The first international Marseille was himself an extremely talented racing pigeon. As a yearling he flew 20th Provincial Chateau Roux, 11th Provincial Montlucan, 19th Provincial Limoges, and also 6th out of 187 pigeons on Quivrain. On Orange, he flew provincially 15 minutes apart and won a first national in the zone before unleashing his devils on Marseille and winning first international. His progeny is unseen on Joe's loft. His blood is interwoven in all the top pigeons that followed afterwards. On other lofts a very strong results were also achieved. Thank you for watching. Until next time.